Hi, my name is Matt Fight. I'm with KTA Tater Incorporated. On my right, I have Dominic Passarelli and Andrew Pappas. They work as sales consultants in the sales and service department. Uh, today, we're going to bring you a quick help video on ASTM D4417 standard test methods for field measurement of surface profile of blast clean steel. Um, Dominic, the first method we want to talk about is actually probably a less commonly used method nowadays as it was in the past. Uh, tell us a little bit about method A of D4417. Yeah, so the blast clean surface is visually compared to five segments of a reference disc attached to an illuminated magnifier. Okay. And, you know, basically I'm looking at that and that looks like a visual assessment only. There's no real way to record the measurements, correct? That is correct. This is a visual assessment only. There is no documentation of it. What could a commonly used practice for this be? Typically this is used after blasters blast the surface and they just want a quick reference check where taking readings via other methods is not feasible. Right, just to make sure they're kind of on par for what they should be, right? Yep. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, method B, we're not going to really get into right now, but that's going to be using a depth micrometer. Uh, method C is going to be the method probably most of you are familiar with. Uh, Andrew, tell us a little bit about method C and how it is performed. So uh, method C is the Testex spring micro loader micrometer. And with this method, you use the replica tape. You take a piece of the tape, you put on the uh, surface of the blasted surface, and you burnish the surface pull off the tape and take a reading. And if you don't mind, could you tell the audience what, what different grades of tape are commonly used? Most commonly you have the coarse and extra coarse grades. Um, typically if you're within that uh, one and a half and two and a half mil range, you want to use both grades. So. You're talking about that, the, the sweet spot overlap that you get. Correct. Right. Okay. Very good. All right, guys, that was just a quick hit video on methods A and C of D4417. Uh, check back to our YouTube page or ktagage.com for further videos.